I'm going to create a new file, some handle uh, container dot js. So here I am going to uh, in this handle container dot js, I am going to uh, give methods. Actually, import, import uh, React, and also here I am giving like component, component from uh, React, and uh, here I am giving like class, class handle container. Container uh, extends extends component. Yeah, here I am giving some constructor as uh, I am not using any uh, state and all here. Just I am using one uh, constructor. I have declared it, and uh, I am giving some uh, get top data. And uh, here I am giving some uh, alert, and uh, I am going to catch some uh, get uh, data, get top data information. information. Okay. And uh, one more thing is get mixed data. I am going to give one more uh, method that is some get mixed data. So this uh, get mixed data I am going to have here like one more alert something like getting a uh, mixed data data component okay so uh, finally i am going for render method and uh, in this uh, uh, render method i am returning some uh, h1 and h2 okay some h1 okay Handler, handler container. So it's like a H1. Uh, handler, handler container, handler container. Okay. Handler container. And uh, here I'm going to export this total uh, component, export default handler container. Okay. Uh, since uh, I have not mentioned here parentheses, the problem is okay. I just created an uh, this method get top data and get mixed data. So I want to call this uh, uh, methods to my uh, to my uh, main component. Okay, so uh, in, the, in my main component, I am going to give the information uh, like this. Yeah, I am going to write the program like this. Import react component component from react okay. and also import uh, i'm going to do render from react term And one more thing is like I am going to import handler container, handler container from handler container uh, JS. And uh, I am going to give here class app extends component. In this, I am going to give like one constructor. And uh, I am going to give super. Okay. Then uh, later I am going to give here a uh, render. Uh, this uh, render I am going to give a uh, return. A uh, return, and uh, here I am giving uh, one div. I am taking a div inside it, and uh, in this div is like a handler container. I'm going to start a start my uh, handler container component. Uh, the ref is like child. This is like a, my reference tag. So with this reference tag, I can able to call the methods. The my reference tag is a child. Okay. So here I am going to give 
बटन सॉरी बटन हियर आई एम गोइंग टू गिव लाइक ऑन क्लिक क्लिक ऑन क्लिक इज इक्वल टू सम दिस डॉट रेफ्स डॉट चेल डॉट गेट टॉप डेटा So I am going to call the get top data. Okay, here I am going to uh, fetch get fetch top data. Just an example, three cell, and uh, one more thing we have here that is like button on click, and uh, here I am going to mention uh, the second method that is this dot. uh refs dot refs dot child dot get one is get top data other one is get mixed data get mixed data so that information i am going to pass here and uh yeah uh yeah okay yeah and now uh, i want to render finally i want to render this app to my root so this like this render uh, this render i am going to give like a app and uh, i am going to mention like document dot get element by id i am going to give here root okay so now mm, i get find like uh, i am going to call this uh, top data and also top get mix data of methods of like uh, handle container handle containers uh, uh, data so here i am going to uh, uh, return uh, handler contain this will be my header and also uh, this uh, all that i am going to uh pass the reference of this uh, child ref uh, uh, equal to child and then i am giving like this dot ref dot uh, this dot uh, ref dot ref dot child get top data and fetch top data like uh, likewise uh, i am going to use and uh, i on second yeah okay so now uh, already i installed this this uh, id equal to already i have mentioned uh, yeah i will go ahead and then start this application Yeah. This is a handler container. It's the problem, and that is defined not used in any useless constructor. Okay. Fine. Yeah. Still, I uh, I can find like uh, the handler container and fetching the top data and uh, fetching the Accept it. So if I click on this, I will get the alert of uh, my handler container get top data information. Okay, and uh, if I click on the mixed data or uh, fetch the mixed data, 
then it will get like a getting mixed data of component okay so the ref is used to uh, get the methods of some other component and uh, we can import them to our uh, main component we can call a pair from a parent component we can call the data uh, we can call the child components methods uh, by passing the uh, ref parameter by uh, by having this ref parameter we can uh, we can refer to that uh, component and its properties yeah one more example also we will see regarding this ref that is uh, yeah I, uh, yeah. So here also I am going to um, create public. I think it's like folder public, and uh, I am going to give here some index dot HTML and uh, nothing. Okay. So from here, I am going to use the uh, div and uh, I am going to mention ID is equal to some uh, root and uh, i am going to mention this um, um, index.js here and uh, here it's like a, uh, here also i am going to uh, uh, i mean uh, get the data of the child tail to my parent here my main motto is uh, to change the colors of the uh, background of a component and uh, by by clicking on the component and uh, mm, I'm going to change the background of the uh, parent component by by, uh, by by clicking on that component. But I am using like a child, child also. I am going to use uh, the child properties also. Once it is clicked, the child properties also should be changed. Uh, both of the parent and change properties uh, should be changed on a click. Uh, that's my uh, main. Uh, um, uh i mean for that i'm going to do this program so first i will go and do, go ahead and then do with the uh, one uh child component so let me do with the uh, child lot some js uh here it's like import uh, react from uh react okay and also uh class child and uh extends sorry extends extends uh, react dot component react dot component and uh, here i am giving like a constructor and uh, here i am using some uh, super i am going to use props here properties okay and uh, here it is like this dot uh, sub sub header Subheader ref. This is my uh, state, uh, not our one variable. I am going to take subheader and uh, one more like this dot set set sub uh, header is equal to. I am giving some element element and uh, I am giving like a set a function. So this dot sub header ref is equal to element. Element. Okay. Yeah. Mm, yeah. Here uh, I want to mention this uh, inside the constructor. Okay. And uh, I am going to give like component update, component it update. So it's like a const, uh, const, and then parent, parent container, click. 
is equal to this dot props and uh, here i am going to use uh, till it will come for that first i will do the render and uh, here i am going to mention like return return uh, due and in this due i am going to mention like h2 header and reference like uh, this dot uh, set subheader ref and uh, i'm going to use here child component this is the child component okay so here in this uh, properties and uh, i mean in this component did update if the parent container is clicked i want to add the class list as uh, blue the class uh, list as blue and uh, uh, else i want to remove the uh, class i want to remove the blue color i just want to add the uh, value of that uh, uh, i mean uh, font color as blue so for that if if uh, parent container container click okay the parent container is uh, clicked then this dot sub uh, subheader uh, ref dot class uh, class list dot add here i am going to mention some the color okay this is about uh, my this is about my uh, parent component uh, sorry child component okay so and uh, here i am going to use here i am going to use this um, uh, uh, so, so now i am going to use this to the uh, parent i am going to import whatever the component i have i have wrote here uh, in this component i am going to use this set sub uh, uh, ref set sub ref and uh, this set sub uh, uh, ref subheader ref i think this set sub header ref this uh, set sub header uh, ref this is the scaling set sub sub header ref set sub header ref so here i am going to get the um, this function and uh, get this uh, sub ref initially that value is null is null and uh, by clicking on this uh, parent container it will become a uh, blue and from the uh, we will see the view from the front end so that you will be more clear here so it's like a uh, index uh, index fine so here i am going to mention this uh, uh, index.js i am going to mention import import uh, react and also i'm going to give here like component component from uh, react from react import and uh, it is like a, a render it is like a render from uh, react dom okay. and also here i am having import child from chain okay and uh, now i am going to give class uh, class app extends extends component extends component here i am giving like a constructor uh, constructor and i am giving like super here Constructor and super, and here I am giving like inside this. I am going to mention this dot state. This dot state is equal to click. After I'm I'm making the clicked value as false. Okay, and uh, I am giving like this dot container. 
container ref. I am mentioning this value as null, and this dot set uh, set container set container ref, and I am giving it element. Is dot uh, container ref is equal to element. Equal to ref, but here it is a problem. Okay. And uh, one more uh, thing here is like handle. Okay. First, uh, I will I will give like a render. In this render, I am going to mention uh, return. First, uh, return. And in this return, I am going to view a div, and uh, ref. Uh, this div should be referring to the this dot this dot uh, set container ref. Okay, set container ref. Okay, this is the one. And uh, here I am giving like on click. On click is equal to. I am going to mention the function inside it. This dot handle click. This dot handle click. Okay. And uh, here I am going to uh, mention some H1 and uh, parent. I, think I will close this one here. The problem, yeah. Uh, parent component. component, and also here I am going to mention the child, whatever the child function I have uh, wrote here. That's the child function I am going to get here in this uh, uh, parent. And I am once the, I am going to give like parent parent container click. Okay, one second. Yeah, I'm going to do parent container click. Okay. And uh, it should be equal to some click. So, yeah. Slash do okay. Uh, one second, I think uh, child, child container, and Do and uh, ref do ref uh, set set container reference set con we are uh, going to refer for our own component here and I am giving some handle click and I'll click and then uh, inside this uh, do I am going to mention I think uh, a do is already open here yeah that's the problem so now it's set free okay. So here, uh, once I am going to click this pair, this parent container. So this parent container will be the property of uh, this uh, child child container, and it will add the uh, class list class list blue for this parent container wherever it is. Suppose if it is here, and uh, uh, the value of this uh child will be once it is like a clicker initially uh and i have to mention here one, one more thing that is like const uh con this const click click uh is equal to this dot state okay i am going to assign the state to the uh, clicker so once the 
I mean, once this uh, parent container is clicked, it will go and uh, get this. Uh, uh, I mean, uh, uh, this property, and it will apply that property to the uh, ref. This is this uh, uh, child child component ref, and also it will change, and also it will change the background color. It, it will change the um, background color to be like uh, uh, red but uh, uh, where it will do it is like i have to give like one handle condition um, i have to give one handle condition here handle uh, handle click and uh, here it is like uh, this uh, if um, if this dot container container ref uh, is equal to this dot container uh, ref dot class list dot toggle toggle I'm giving some red okay. and uh, and also this dot set state I'm going to set the state of the clicked here uh, once it's like uh, clicked and uh, I'm going to mention this dot state dot click okay. so initially the clicked state will be false once I click on this uh, div it will become true and also it will change the uh, I mean class of the container class of this container this uh, um, container will to be like a uh, red okay so it will yeah you'll see like uh, from the front end how it will be passed second I, think, uh, I should stop this Here I am going to start. Okay. Second, I will get this. Okay, start this. Uh, I didn't install mode. Did install. Yeah, it will take some couple of minutes.
render app from our document dot settlement by id Here also okay, now it is done. So when we start this one. Export. So it does not contain default export. Okay. Export, export default. Export default change. Styles. Not to mention that some styles are good. to mention uh, styles actually some dot um, or red because whatever the class is mentioning out there that is uh, just like a class and i want to give a background color uh, the red it is mentioned as like red if it is uh, blue that should be mentioned as some uh, color as color as blue and uh, and also yeah so now i can uh, find uh, okay, i should import this uh, to the main component that is like import uh, import dot Style style not CSS. Yeah, 
this, but it is there outside this. Then it is like I will pull this to the inside. So now I will now I will uh, access on to the style lot CSS. It is not recognizing the style of CSS on second. Uh, Yeah, fine. Now you can find it. You can see, see the my here like uh, the child component, whatever I have clicked, that uh, will be clicked. And if it is become true, if it is like a, a true, then it will go and it will go and get here this uh, blue blue reference, and that will go and uh, from my from my index dot js, it will go and fetch from the CSS. Since it is a class list, it is a class list. I am going to get that value here from the class list. Add blue to this uh, component. So, uh, but the blue value is like only for the font. Can able to find like color. Color means only for the font. Okay, and uh, uh, and also from the parent parent side. If I click on this uh, uh, component, then it should go and hit this. Container ref, container ref is nothing but uh, it is an uh, it will give like element, just an uh, element, self binded element, uh, element. And here, if it is uh, true, then it will go and uh, uh, add this class list as red. But this red is nothing but here it is available as background color as red. So likewise, uh, and also it will change the state once the uh, uh, I mean, once the state is, uh, I mean, once the pa uh, this uh, uh, parent is clicked, it will change the state to the uh, true. Yeah, and uh, yeah, that that will give again here the value true, and uh, in this parent component or parent container clicked, it will um, once it is it, that will reflect here, like the value as true. And uh, finally, it will add the blue color to the child. That's how it will happen. People are having doubts in this uh, concept. Public and uh, one more thing is like a SRC. So in the public, I am going to mention index dot uh, HTML. Here I am going to here I am going to do div, div, div and uh, id put okay. id root okay. and uh, here I am going to mention index on js. And uh, yeah, so uh, 
is like a higher order component gets input as a uh, gets component as input as input and returns new component component okay so here uh, i am going to mention a class here first of all uh, like uh, first time they take like import Import and then here I'm going to use uh, React and also I'm going to use like component component from uh, React okay and also it's like import and uh, render from uh, React DOM now here it is like class uh, i am going to use some parent extends component here i am going to use um, render and uh, here i am going to mention like some uh, return uh, I am going to use uh, do inside this one do tag and uh, here I am giving some h1 like mm, cities mm, yeah and uh, here I am giving some um, props uh, data. This dot uh, some props data. It's like uh, properties uh, data. It's like this dot uh, props dot some data. I'm going to mention. And uh, here I have ended this. Yeah. And uh, I'm going to do like render app in the document dot uh, get element by ID and here I'm doing some root put it root right yes and uh, here I am going to pass uh, my app whatever the app component i have mm, I'm going to pass this app to some hoc higher order container higher order component and uh, with some parent i'm going to pass this uh, parent component to a, a function okay to a function and uh, that function i am going to return to one app and i am going to render it so whatever this component is returning that should go and that should pass as a value as a parameter to one uh, function and uh, that should give me the, a new component okay so in this case uh, i am i have to declare one more function that is like where which was in some parameter i am giving some uh, parameter and class extends class extends component okay here i am going to you like a render and uh, again here it is like a return Uh, return and uh, here it is like a parameter parameter and uh, this dot state this dot okay and here I am going to mention component date mode component 
component is one of this dot set state that state here I am going to mention data uh, whatever whatever the data I am having here uh, one second okay. this dot set state I am going to pass like data uh, source i will declare one data source here that's like a where data source um some data here i'm giving some uh, value like general. okay and uh, now i am going to use the data source here data source uh, some adult data so yeah data source dot data and uh, yeah so in this uh, example uh, what i have done is like i have taken the parent component and uh, uh, i have taken a parent component and i am going to uh, pass the properties here you can find a, a props data property but this data property i am going to get this from one more function okay as a one one more function but i am passing this parent as a parameter i am uh, passing this parent as a parameter to one function to, to one function in that function i am going to get the value of this dot props data okay this dot props data and i am passing that data value to the i am passing that uh, data value to uh, my uh, dom okay so yeah it's uh, like uh, yeah and here it, uh, the finally this will return the uh, data value uh, to the main component uh, i mean to the uh, parent component and uh, it will return this value to the DOM. So as you see, higher order component is a component which will pass a function as a parameter and it will return us a new function. Okay, it will, it will return us a new function. So let us uh, go and see the view now of it is. It's like uh, it's not a problem. One second, Could not find uh, the file index dot HTML render. Next dot HTML. HTML. It's like a do ID wrote and uh, index. This index I am going to use. Uh, this index I am going to use. Uh, import a React component from React. Import under from render term. And uh, I have taken a uh, data source. And uh, uh, where HOC higher order component equal to some uh, parameter and uh, this parameter tends to the class extends component render return parameter i am going to start call the uh, all, all state parameters here and uh, uh, in the component date mount i am going to start state data data source dot data class parent i am having like extends component render return do city of cities of india props this start props dot data and constant at uh, ship of the choice 
and parent document dot detachment by ID. Okay. So here it is like. Once again, I will check one more time this here also. Not find the required file. Public, but find not able to find it. Okay, not able to find it. One second, I think we have done. I will uh, reinstall this. Uh, components i mean it might not be properly installed something De delete the node modules and give it a name. Yeah.
one second i think uh, i think the uh, writing one second i'll check That's an oh, it is a uh, User charge on public. Okay. Oh, okay, fine. Mm, I, don't know. I will close this and open again. component public you have a component uh, public mm. component public okay. so then we should uh, fetch this one right if it's if it, we got it. <laughs> Wait, is okay. Is it uh, but up to here the components it is uh, fetching, but uh, there is some uh, comp problem here while it is fetching this public. Okay, uh, I think I will uh, delete this one better. I will delete this uh, I am RF and uh, public. Uh, okay. So now it's not there. Should not be uh, available. Okay. Um, okay. I will it from here. That's that's better. I think so. Mm. So now if I fetch this public, yeah, now it's fetching. Here it is index dot the due and here it is ID uh root one second I will go for my program. Yeah. 
So now, now it's available. This uh, public somehow was uh, not fetching that uh, public folder. Natraj, you are there, right? Yes, S1, just uh, five minutes ago, he dropped, he got a production call. Okay, uh, that's okay. Yeah. So now we can find this uh, props value list of cities. There is some problem while we are creating this new public folder and somehow it was not uh, fetching the path. Um, yeah. You got this, uh, um, Concept now. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. Fine. Um, so uh, I will I will send you these uh, programs so you can practice them. Um, uh, tomorrow we'll see about the uh, new new topics, and uh, yeah, I will send you this GitHub link too. You can uh, check that. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Thanks, Shetami. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Nathan. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.